thematic is really a possibility to bring different aspects of life together, like art, science, spirituality. The combination of understanding motion and form and experimenting in a new way. The thematic explains all. Us, the macro and the micro universe. It's very important, this. You make the invisible visible. I think even chaos has to be a part of what cymatics would study, and that means everything. Then. It's possibly to catch and touch the universe when, when you experiment at the cymatics. Cymatics can show us the flow of chi, and this is life. The basic Kladni phenomena is a metal plate on which powder has been strewn as evenly as possible and then bowed with a, with a violin bow. And what happens is the powder suddenly separates. It starts moving in specific directions and suddenly becomes ordered. You have an ordered pattern on this plate that is vibrating. The sound becomes visible. We have an Austrian poet who said, there's a song in everything. And that's what makes it possible to see this, what he said. It's uh, very uh, unpredictable. It's a non-linear phenomenon inside. All the forces of the nature are concentrated in the mouth of the human being. It is just becoming word. You can express that. To get in touch with the phenomena, you don't need to be an expert. The phenomena is just there, and it's only the question, how do I observe? How do I interact with the phenomena as an I, only as a person? I don't need a scientific background for that, or I just need to observe and just need to open my mind and open my senses to let the phenomena speak. The science is good, but not, cannot explain all. Science can be imaginative and artistic as well, I think. The problem is splitting the two apart, really. It's trying to bring the two together. So we started the first World Cymatics Congress because there was no institution, no place in the world where all different contributions to cymatics comes together at one point, like a crystallization point. So we found this lovely venue of Allerheiligen, which is All Saints, to meet for four days with roughly 170 people from 16 countries. And they came to a real work process all together with very much human interaction, human connections. The Congress was initiated by Atmani. He composed the event to bring art and science together in a new way. Research in cymatics started with the work of Hans Jenny, a physician with a strong scientific and artistic inner life. It was the task of Atmani to take Jenny's cymatic approach and form it into a new method of investigating the world. He focused the Congress to the key question of how the visible world develops out of the tone. As a researcher and artist, Admani has dedicated his work and his life to the word and to the human voice. He shows that with the new cymatics method, it is possible to find the development out of the word into the world within all sciences and arts. 
you need the lecture to get the ideas and to have an idea of the different approaches, the different works. But the essential point are the workshops, where people gather together, find the phenomena, have a look for the phenomena. It's a rhythmic pulsation. The water pulsates. There is an inherent uh, movement in the water. Water always wants to make vortices, or always wants to make longitudinal uh, spirals. Uh, and this is what we find also in somatics. If there is some impulse, there is a repulse of the water. Where does this motion come from? Why uh, does water want to move in that way? Is water a living substance? Is water an organism? We don't know, but we know that all what we call life comes out of water. Because water and life um, comes out of the same stream of history and I think both are together all the time. I don't know whether life or the water was earlier, when only a little bit, because in all um, formations we see life all the time. When I draw, I, I, I uh, think uh, to be one to observation, uh, a second to understanding, and the third to love, to be emotion and passion. Without these three, uh, you cannot uh, realize a good drawing. And uh, when you combine this observation, this, uh, you know, understanding, and this uh, uh, loving that's possibly to illustrate the universe. I go in uh, after a few days in my lab and I work. And sometimes I was surprised. I appear the, the human face. It's fantastic. It's difficult to reproduce because it's like uh, you play uh, in a roulette. Not all the time the linear uh, uh, experiment, it's the same, because it's, you need to grow the intensity of uh, uh, sounds and after stay, and after grow, and after uh, go back a little bit, and after grow the intensity. It's not linear, it's not enough the frequency, the viscosity, the type of shape. You, you must know how to grow. The Cymatics Congress is an opportunity where for the first time artists, researchers and the participants come together from very different approaches and find themselves in the cymatic phenomena, which is much broader than only vibration and matter. The pipe dream I have is to have a system where the music and the cymatics a one unity and that everything interlocks. There's one straw that you can hang on to, I think, and that's the straw if you work on yourself, trying to develop your consciousness. That's the only hope. That is the only hope. There's no, no other straw. We are a semantic inside. We are a build with semantic.